Hi guys and welcome back to another video with me and baby V. Um, I should probably introduce myself as Chantel, but uh, I never do. Anyways, I wanted to go ahead and get on here and introduce this video because it is our travel vlog with a toddler on an airplane. My first time on an airplane, her first time on an airplane, traveling hours away, um, doing a layover. We did do two flights, so it's kind of like just a little crazy, hectic, um, just the things that we did, uh, but it actually went better than what I expected it to go, and I mean, it was just really good. She liked the turbulence, oddly, which was really weird, um, but she liked that, and I just wanted to go ahead and get on here and let you guys know um, that the beginning of this video is going to be us, before we left, we went on a, like, to do an activity in the car, which was a car wash. And um, so that'll be at the beginning of the video and then I'll get into like the real information about like how it was with traveling. So I hope that you guys enjoy and let's get into this video. It's a party! Come here, stand up! Oh, hell no! Is it too loud? Oh, no. And welcome back to another video with me and baby V. <laughs> we have made it to the airport and I don't know what makes me nervous is she slept <laughs> before we got here and now I don't know if she's gonna slip on this light. I have a feeling she's not but who knows. Um, here do you want to go this way? I did put her pajamas on backwards if you guys could see her. Where are you going? But she had gotten sick before. We had like this whole outfit for her and then she got sick right before we went to um, get in the car. So that was a whole thing. <laughs> We're waiting for um, Jose, Jose and Jose. Oh, you need help? We're waiting for them to get back because they went to go drop off the cars. And then, yeah. So we've had a bit of a rut, but not with our stuff. We did need to sign our passports and I had to sign Valentina's passports. Um, but I'm just walking around with her to keep her entertained as better as best as possible. That is probably the worst angle. Um, so that's what's going on right now. But they're back there, if you can see them at all. <laughs> and this is Valley. Hey, 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 hey. Best thing that you can have is this i must say it is a must when you are traveling anywhere because this little does not like you to carry her hand at all so must to 
our first stop. <laughs> we rode our first plane. Valley did great. We didn't have any huge issues or anything like that. Um, what was it? She just was like <laughs> really tired. So right now she's like knocked out. So other than that, though, everything went like really well and whatnot. So we're in Atlanta, which is our first stop, and we're gonna head to our destination. So I'll keep you guys in the loop, I guess. Okay, see ya. or closings really for like any of these videos like she did really good the first flight she was up for the most part it was like five something in the morning and she was up for majority of the flight until like the end um which she wanted to go be with jose's um mom because they were like in the road like beside us so we went and gave her to her mom she put her to sleep and um it is very cramped. I would definitely suggest if your kid is over 12 months old and they're like a bigger kid, like 16, like Valley's 16 months right now, I think 16 or 17. No, she's 16 months. So because of that, um, I would say get them a seat because it's really, really needed. Um, because we were cramped, I'm not even gonna lie. In our first flight, we were sitting next to another person. Um, so it was just, I felt bad for her, but it was just because Valley was like moving all around. And she was like, hi, you know, doing all these things and it's super early in the morning. But they ended up giving us snacks, which kept her entertained. They gave us drinks, which also kept her entertained because she loves ice. She liked the screen that's on like the computer and they give us headphones. So she really liked that. Um, she didn't really wear her headphones. I just watched the TV or played games on the um, TV that's on the seat. Um, we did give her like these ear things and I can link everything down below, but I might do a video of like what I actually packed in her bag for the flight. Um, but I can link that down below. Everything I got was off of Amazon. Uh, flight, of course, after we ate, because we had um, the three hour layover and then they started boarding pretty early because you know, you're going to a different country and you have to have your passport and it's different things like that so they started boarding early and then we ended up getting on the flight um 
and we just did everything like normal we didn't get on earlier or anything like that um just because we wanted her to be off of the plane as long as possible the second flight she went to sleep pretty soon and because she was just exhausted the day had gone by so fast um so the second flight she went to sleep and then um she didn't wake up until towards the end which was like maybe an hour into the end and she was just having like a blast like doing things playing with like the different activities like i got her several books so that she could play with and she was playing with those she played with the screen um she did not let me go to the bathroom by myself so i had to go into the bathroom uh really really quick and then come out luckily we were really close to the bathroom which i would highly suggest and we're coming out of the air to land in Mexico there was a ton of turbulence so she was excited and she was like oh yay uh, however everybody else is like freaking out and panicking but it ended up going really really well she did really good and then we got here and of course you can't use your phones or anything like that um, once you're checking your bags and getting all of the information for immigration and stuff like that so that was a whole <laughs> Thing, but she did really well with that as well and I would just suggest like if you're going to take a flight maybe take someone with you instead of just having yourself because it's super super helpful to at least have a second hand regardless if they are like a spoiled kid to you I did have her like the whole entire both flights except for like towards the end for the second flight but like she was on my lap the whole entire time down here and kind of end the vlog thank you guys so much for watching i will be doing some airplane tri tips and tricks once we get back home to see how it goes for the second flight um but yeah i hope that you guys have a great morning night or day and bye